Hello, hello. I am super excited to share with you something that I have been playing around with a little bit today. Um, and that is live photos on Facebook. This is a really fun new feature. I'm really excited about it. Um, and I hope that this is helpful for you and it's something that you find value in. So go ahead and go into your app store. The first thing you want to do is download this into live app. Okay, so this is what it looks like. There is a free version and then a pro version. The free version, I believe, lets you upload up to five photos at a time for a slideshow where the pro version is unlimited. So um, play around with the free version, see if you like it, and then go ahead and invest in the pro version. I think it's well worth it. And I don't think that I actually paid $2.99. I think it was on sale today. Um, so a little incentive to hop on that soon. Um, so once you get that downloaded, you're going to go ahead and go into that app. over here and then you have a couple of different options you can do a video in the background you can do a gif in the background or you can do a photo slideshow for today I chose to do a photo slideshow so what I did was I went into my favorite photo editing app which is word swag um, you choose your favorite and go ahead and edit a cover photo so you want to choose a photo preferably of you and then um, give them a little instruction so it says for a fun surprise press here and hold so you want to give them a little button to press on okay you want to make it pretty clear what you want them to do and then you're gonna go ahead and pick your other photos that you want to be in the slideshow that goes when they press and hold so always make sure you pick your cover photo first and then pick the rest of your photos that you want to be in the slideshow okay and then you're going to click the little red make button up in the right hand corner and it will compile your slideshow for you okay all right and it gives you a little preview of what it looks like down there in the bottom you have a few different options you can add some filters you can change the size of your photos and then that little timer clock button if you push on that that will let you adjust the speed of your slideshow um, I highly suggest slow just so that it gives people some time to look at the photos before they rush by okay so that's what the slow speed looks like I think that's just about perfect and then when you like what you've got you push the red arrow in the upper right hand corner and that's going to take you to what it will look like on Facebook okay so you get to do the little press here and hold try it out it's pretty fun okay and then when you're satisfied with that you're gonna click that little save live photos down in the lower right hand corner and it will save directly to your camera roll all right so going into Facebook now to show you how to upload it it'll go in just like any other photo with a little bit of a twist okay so pick your photos your camera roll now you see my cover photo down there it says press here and hold that's where it's saved so I'm gonna select that done and then down in the lower right hand corner this is important you want to make sure that live button down there you want to make sure that it's pressed so that it says live and the lines not through it okay and that lets you look at a little preview of it again and there you go and then you would post it you can say something about it if you want to um, I already posted mine for today so I'm not gonna post this one but I'll show you what it looks like once it's live that's it so the people that are looking at it are gonna press and hold and they get to watch your slideshow which I think is super fun. Okay, all right, so that is what it looks like. Now, I played around with it a little bit and I've noticed that it does not work in groups or in events. So I suggest you post your live photo to your wall and then either share it to your groups or events or I think you can also post it on your um, business page, okay? So now I wanna show you what it looks like when you do a video. I love, love, love this, okay? So this is a little sped up video I did yesterday of me putting on the mascara. So I'm gonna pick that video. This is a little bit different than when you're doing a slideshow on the live photos, because you're gonna pick your video first and then pick your cover photo. So once you've got your video picked, you go to the next screen and down there in the lower left-hand corner where it says edit first frame, you want to pick that and then you're going to pick your cover photo from there okay 
So down there in the lower right hand corner where the little mountain is showing um, for your camera roll, you know, pick that and that'll pull up your photos, photo album. And then I haven't had a chance to edit this photo yet, but this is the photo I wanted to pick and it will say, it'll have a button on it. It'll say something like, um, click here, press here and hold to watch me get epic lashes or something like that. I'll be a little bit more creative than that, I promise. <laughs> okay, and then you just press and hold on that photo and it's gonna show you preview what they see. I think it's really, really cool because it kind of just blurs out your cover photo in the background and lets the video play over the top of it. And I think it's really visually appealing. I love that option, okay? So then I would save that, save live photos. And again, that's just gonna save to your camera roll and you can go and post it in Facebook just like a normal photo. Just make sure that you click that live photo. So I hope that was super helpful. I'm really excited to see what you guys come up with. Feel free to share with us here once you've posted to your wall um, and show us what you've got. Talk to you ladies later. Hope you have a fabulous day.